So guys, we need to talk about the cheater problem from Hunt Showdown. But is cheating in Hunt Showdown really a problem? Or is it just players who have skill and know to use the features from Hunt to outplay some other guys? So if you see here, I'm on the Hunt Showdown forum, cheaters and hackers. The last few days so much people call about me, including me, talking about discussion. If you go here to relevance, yeah, one hour ago, 71 posts, 53 posts, 19 April, so it's a lot of posts just about cheating and hacking in a game. But the game has not really a big player base, so what is the reason for that and why do people complain about cheating? That's what I want to talk about in this video. So yeah, it's just that I said it. I'm not here to say Han Shodan has no cheaters and all people who write about cheaters are lying and are stupid guys or something. They are right, we have cheaters, but I say it's not really a cheater problem. It's right, I read down here. So every game has cheaters, every competition has cheaters, if it is in real life or is it in just in a game like Hunt. Do we really have a big cheater problem compared to other games or is it just like yeah some people's cheating and we can live with that and the devs are doing the best so we will see. So also what Max is back is running here so easy anti-cheat is a big system so it's a, from a company who is working on an anti-cheat system so more than one game are using the same system and the devs from a game can adjust the settings and make it better for their own games. But all this means you have a lot of games who are using the same anti-cheat and if someone finds an exploit then everyone can use the exploit for all the other games. So that's what I mean and also he's right in here. It's not unusual to see a short flight of cheater activity in the weeks after a new exploit is released. So and because of that we have a lot of time. They need a lot of time to fix these exploits and that's why we have some weeks where you can see more cheaters and sometimes we, uh, it's better so we just can hope they have a long time to find the next exploit, but they will find an exploit every time. It's like going up, they find an exploit, they fix it, they find a new exploit, they fix it again. And it's like, it's like a death circle. It starts from beginning, it starts again and then again. And yeah, it's every time the same shit. Science years in every game, every time it's the same shit. Another reason why people complain about cheaters and wall hacking is also that we have the feature in the game called Dark Side Boost. You can use it, it's like a legal wall hack, you got it for 10 seconds, so all people who are playing that game know how it works. So here is a clip, it shows exactly what I mean and it happens so often and so often people will complain about wall hacking and this clip is already shown just on a small range but exactly the same you can do on 50 meters so just watch it and you will see what I mean mm -hmm. So guys, that was a clip from me, I was playing, so I know there was a guy somewhere around and I just checked it with the dark side boost and then pre aimed and shot him in the head, so few people will complain about wall hacking, yes, they're right, but it's legal wall hack from the game, so it's not really a problem, but yeah, it's a point why people complain about cheating, and another point is... The maps are built like if you look on the walls or fences, there are everywhere little holes where you can watch between the wood and you can watch outside and see people walking around. If you know they are here, you can shoot them through wood and through walls. And also if you shoot people through windows, it got cold, you shoot them through a wall. So 
And if the other guy is not knowing you are there and you shoot him through these wood holes, to the, to the little floor holes or just through the window, they're thinking you got wall hacks. So I do this a lot of times. I have a lot of clips and I want to show them all now to you. And I think 99% of the guys I killed there will think I got wall hacks. So just watch the clips, write down in the comments what you think about these clips. I'm interested about. Just enjoy it. Ja, ist mir wurscht. Was? Mit was? R1, push them now. In the corner. I killed the grunts. That's what I know. Oh, there he is. Oh. Fucking nice, bro.
Sehr schön, geil. Shut him on. <laughs> the other side of the building, I saw. He's trying to, he's trying to flank. Oh, he's at uh, the ladder. There's a dead hunter inside the green shack. See him? Yeah, me too. What the fuck? What? What is? Two hunters there. The headshot one with the windfield. You are too slow, man. I need to headshot them for. No, but it, it teleports me back, bro, because I'm sitting on fucking. Uh... Ah, if you got the same issue like me last time. Very nice, no? He's in the green shack. You hit him? Nah. Sure he doesn't revive his friend. Yeah, I'm watching there. But I don't know where he is. I need to be careful, I'm gonna get rushed, fuck bad, show me. I headshot him again, I don't know what Thing right? Yeah, he's dead. I got the all hanger in. I need to open the fence the whole time. I can't rock the mall hanger in, though. I'm going to go to the fence. Oh, it's a bit of a look. Shit, I'm nice.
So guys, we got now two reasons why people thinking some other guys are wall hacking. The one, the first thing was uh, dark side boost. It's kind of legal wall hack. It works. No problem there. So the second one is just skill and map knowing. You need to know where you can watch two holes. You need to know on which locations you have these holes, and you need to know through which materials on the map you can shoot so you can shoot easily through wood and sometimes you can shoot through brick walls you need to know where i played now 800 hours i know where you can shoot through and know where not sometimes it works not sometimes it works it's just every time a little bit luck included also and now we have a third thing why people complain about wall hacking and this thing is kind of annoying it's like bugs so it's like he, he's writing here, why would anyone need a cheat in this dumb and broken game where walls not even render? So I don't want to call the game dumb and broken, I played it 800 hours now, I really enjoy the game. So, But yeah, it's kind of annoying, sometimes walls does not render, fences does not render. Uh, on the new map, Erden Parish, if we come down from the north, sometimes the tower is not rendered, you can watch inside the old tower. You can see people walking around there sometimes. You can shoot them through the wall, it's just wood. With long bullets, no problem. So before it was on Blanchard Graves, you can see through walls and brick walls. Sometimes on close range you can shoot through the wood. Uh, through the brick walls, sorry and that. And another time it was on Healing Waters. Maybe 4.0 patch. You can shoot through the uh, wood walls from the church sometimes they were not rendered and you can see people's walking around outside and so and the thing is if you know there is normally a wall and you know they can't see you inside because from the view of the other players there is a wall and yeah you can say yeah it's moral I don't shoot them I play fair or you just shoot them why not it's not your fault so mostly I should because it's not my fault so the other thing is if you self don't know if you walk around you see a fence or you see a guy in the middle of the fence there is there's one part there is no fence you see them walking around you shoot them down then you go to the player and you see them there was a fence it was just not rendered and that's exactly what I got I clipped this, I had, I had a lot of si such situations, sometimes maybe you don't even know it and you never will know it again because you don't go to check or to loot the body, So, but I managed it to clip one of that situations, here is the clip, just watch it, it says everything. Or the boss is here and they are still there. Yeah, they are here, they are here, on the clue, on the clue. Great. Yeah, one is inside the building. Both are inside the building. You can throw a big one in. Come on, do it. Do it now. He's fucking stupid. And the other one is in the front in the uh, building where the entrance gate is. No, I've I destroyed the whole gate. <laughs> oh, he's on the east side of it. Oh, come on, dogs, oh, shut up. He was so he was fucked up. Uh, the first guy I killed. Guy I killed. He was hiding on the wrong side of the building. Oh. Oh 
Oh, really? Here is a fence? Oh, on my screen the fence was not here, it was like a wall hack. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I killed him through the fence, and I don't know there was a fence. In, in my screen, there was nothing. You got back your Denima? Back your Denima? Oh, one. No. I don't know why. So, guys, I don't know what I should say about that clip. It's just like fuck me stupid. That's the only, re the biggest reason why people complain about wall hacks. So it was a wall hack, but it was not, it was like a bug. I didn't even know that there should be a fence. Even I would go the moral way and say, I don't shoot people through unrendered buildings. I just don't know it. I just shoot because I saw a guy, he was in the open field and I was thinking, he's fucking stupid. Why is he going there? And after I realized, oh fuck, there was no fence, so yeah, too late, sorry, but I was just playing the game. Yeah, and that's a problem of hunt, one of the biggest problems, I think, and they need to fix it. So, and now I want to talk about of some solutions. For the first two reasons, for the dark side boost, and for the other reason, the skill and map knowing, we have that. Kill cams and death cams. Why not add a, a kill cam? Why not? Yeah, you can say if you add a kill cam, you your mate got killed. And then he see the video and he say you or TeamSpeak or Discord, yeah he is there and then you can shoot him. No, we don't want that. That's fucking stupid. We don't want like a death cam wall hack. This is another reason for bullshit. No, we don't want that. What we want is if my mate got killed and I got killed also. So we are both dead. I want to watch how I got killed and I want to see how my mate got killed. Not, not long clips, just a half minute. Just a half minute. Maybe 20 seconds before the kill and 10 seconds after. So, But just show it after both of one team are dead not when one player is dead don't show it no we don't want that it's it's more it's it's another wall hack we don't want another wall hack the only thing i want or the most players want is to see how i got killed and why i got killed if i if my mate got killed and i kill both of the other players no problem I don't want to see how my mate got killed. Maybe at the end of the game you can show it. Maybe. But it don't, it don't really need that. But if we both got killed, I want to see a half minute clip how I got killed and I want to see a half minute clip how he got killed. So I can see, oh, he was using dark side boost. He saw me behind that tree. He shoot me through the tree. It was legit. No problem with that. Or I want to see... Yeah, my mate was walking there and he was sitting in a building and there was a small crack near a window and he was watching through this crack and shoot him on 20 meters with that fucking pistol. Yeah, okay. Unlucky for my mate. He got killed. Was legit. No problem. We want that, not more. And that's the thing. The only thing it does not work is on the last problem, the bugs. The rendering is different on every computer. So, if my mate, if I kill someone through a fence because I don't see the fence, and he watched the death cam, it looks like I shoot him through the fence. So it's, it's like I had wall hacks because on his death cam it would look like I shoot him through fence, because the fence is just on my computer, not there. So this will not fix this last part. This last part is the only part the devs should complain about. Not about the anti-cheat. Just fix these bugs, these rendering issues. Also, there is another issue if you set your graphics very low, you have more of these rendering bugs. Please don't do it. It's fucking stupid and the game looks boring. So I don't want to talk more about that. This is like bug using, so... Don't do it. Because I used all these nice gameplay clips for making this video about cheating and hacking. Yeah, 
no highlight video this week. So the next one is coming. It will come the next week. So now the end screen, I did it. Enjoy the music, enjoy the kills, chill out and have a nice day. I'm out. Goodbye. Will ich wirklich so Fans?